Find root of equation x cube minus 4x minus 9 equal to 0. So what is our equation x cube minus 4x minus 9? So it will be our f of x. So our equation is f cube minus 4x minus 9. So our f of x will be x cube minus 4x minus 9. Now put x equal to 0 in this equation. So when x equal to 0, 0 cube minus 4 into 0 minus 9 that will be equal to minus 9. Now put x equal to 1. So when x equal to 1, we will get 1 cube minus 4 minus 9 that will be equal to minus 12. Now put x equal to 2. 2 cube minus 4 into 2 minus 9 that will be equal to minus 9. Now when x equal to 3, f of 3 equal to that will be equal to 6. Now you can see here this is a negative value and here it is a positive value. We need to get adjacent negative and positive value. So our interval so our interval will lie between negative value and positive value. So our interval will be when x equal to 2 and when x equal to 3. At x equal to 2, we will get negative value. In x equal to 3, we will get positive value. We need to get adjacent negative and positive value. That will be our interval. So we get the interval. That is step 1. Now find the x1. That is our next step. x1 equal to a plus b by 2. So our a value is 2 and b value is 3. So 2 plus 3 by 2 that will give 5 by 2 that is 2.5 that is our new x1. Now we got x1 equal to 2.5. So when x equal to 2.5 we need to put x in this equation. So f of 2.5 that will be equal to minus 3.375. So here it is a negative value. If it is a negative value, replace interval A. If it is a positive value, replace interval B. So here it is a negative value. So we are going to replace interval A. We are going to replace interval A with x equal to 2.5. So our new interval will be so our new interval will be 2.5, 3. Now do the second iteration. So x2 equal to a plus b by 2 that will be 2.5 plus 3 by 2 that will be equal to 2.75. Now put x equal to 2.75. So now x equal to 2.75. Now do f of 2.75. Substitute in this equation with x equal to 2.75. That is equal to 0 0.76. 0.7968 so here it is a positive value if it is a positive value we need to replace interval b so our new interval will be equal to 2.5 comma then we are going to replace interval b interval b because our answer is a positive value so we are going to replace interval b with 2.5 75. So our root lies between 2.5 and 2.75. Like that, do the remaining iteration and you will get root between 2.5 and 2.75. So our final answer will be our root will be. So do the number of iteration as mentioned in the question. And for this question, the final root will be equal to 2.7065. So do the number of iteration mentioned in the question and we will get root. The answer will be lying between 2 and 3. And here it is 2.7065. That is bisection method.